welcome back to Grace SpaceX. Elon Musk has just revealed the challenges in producing the Starship rocket. The root cause comes from a tweet by a space fan with the username Jerry, who gives a comparison image of the rockets using methane and oxygen, including Terran 1, Terran R, Vulcan, New Glenn, and Starship that will be able to launch this year. And Elon Musk responded, Design is easy, production is hard. Why do you suppose he said that? It's absolutely true, currently there are many beautiful and perfect 2D and 3D designs of SpaceX's Starship on social networks and media such as YouTube and Twitter. But the design, drawing, and the production are completely different. That's also why, among a bunch of other private companies, only SpaceX can produce Starship. So, what are the specific challenges in Starship production? First, technical challenge. Elon Musk employs some of the smartest engineers on this planet, and they're still, in many ways, fumbling towards solutions for the extremely hard problem of getting a super large vehicle out of Earth's gravity and well into orbit, then land it and fly it again. Starship is huge, with a diameter of 9 meters and will be 120 meters high when combining the two stages together. It will be the biggest rocket of all time. This size will interfere with the assembly of stainless steel parts. In addition, Starship will be designed to keep itself from burning up in the atmospheres of Mars and Earth by adding lots of heat shields to its hull. Next, inside the Starship Super Heavy, it integrates a lot of things. The second stage will be designed to become a cargo area and at the same time will be equipped with many seats, entertainment, and rest areas for 100 passengers. The first stage is the Super Heavy Booster, which is intricately designed with tanks containing materials such as methane and oxygen during flight. The hardest part of any rocket is the engine, and SpaceX is almost there with the Raptor engine iterations. Indeed, engineers will have to work out the most powerful Raptor ever to be able to transport goods and people to Mars, a distance of 368.49 million kilometers or 229 million miles from Earth. Through tests, Raptor held the record for the highest combustion chamber pressure ever reached by an operational rocket engine at 330 bar, surpassing the record held by the RD-701 rocket engine at 300 bar. The second is financial challenge. None of this is cheap. Boca Chica is a fairly remote location to ship materials to, and the company has gone really fast, sparing few expenses. How long can it go like this, and how is he paying for all of this? Musk declined to offer specifics. From building the infrastructure at Starbase, the equipment needed to assemble, shipping the materials, and estimated production cost of a Starship rocket prototype costing around $216 million, we can see that this billionaire is trying to burn his money in this space race. Finance is considered a huge barrier in the production of rockets, not only for SpaceX. But until now, SpaceX is still doing a great job developing its own fully reusable rocket. We're looking forward to the first orbital flight scheduled to take place next month. That's all for today's episode. Let us know what your thoughts on today's topics in the comments below. Remember to thumbs up if you enjoyed this episode and subscribe if you haven't. And don't forget to hit the bell to be notified of future Grace Space X content. Thanks!